G'day guys, welcome back to the show. I'm actually home for the weekend and I don't even know what I'm doing for this episode yet. It will just depend on what I do this weekend, but we'll probably just make a weekend episode. I'll do a few things, go out in your beauty for the first time in months. Uh, I don't know, go for a dive. Well, that's what I'm doing now. Anyway, I'm going for a dive and a fish. Might try and get some squid, lobsters, fish. I don't even know, but yeah, you'll see. You'll find out, I guess. Um, yeah, so I'll put some of my favorite pop smoke on, get in the diving mood, and I'll see you there. You. She liked the way that I move. Actually, before I go for a dive, I'll roll back yesterday's footage, which was going out in your beauty for the first time in months, which was a great experience. And yeah, I'll roll back that now, and I'll see you soon. You. Back home, if you couldn't tell by the way, first time in like three months I've been home, been away and been diving up the gong, but it's looking clear. It has rained yesterday and a few days before that, so got the dive stuff, got the fishing stuff, and we'll just see how we go. Welcome to the channel, Lockie. Thanks, mate. Good to have you on board, Jed. Jed's back. <laughs> Lockie's going to boat you for us, he doesn't dive when we're diving and we'll see if it's clear or not and then we'll fish and try and get some snapper and stuff like that. Got a couple new rods by the way, I'll show you guys when we're out there. But yeah, some good gear today. Boys just fishing. We're just going to fish this wash off this island because it's a lot more swelly than what we thought. We can jump in somewhere but we're going to have to go somewhere protected because like, there's just waves and it's like this weird nor'easter swell so it's not too promising don't want to be a Debbie Downer but yeah it's a bit weird but we'll still manage to fish or dive backhand sorry solid oh, look at all that lube beautiful this shit is the bomb I can you catch Jumped in, wasn't expecting much. The visuals was, wasn't bad actually. And yeah, I managed a couple bars of trumpeter. I don't like them that much, but Lockie might like them. Nice so, size as well, wasn't much else out there. Chad got a nice little brim and a very healthy red bull. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go for another dive and Lockie go and fish, might even anchor up. And yeah, hopefully the next spot's a bit better, but no complaints. Slowly feeling the esky and get some fish on deck. Okay, see you there. Ew. So we hopped in from our dive. The last spot was dirty as. Didn't get much. I think Jed got a drum art and an abalone. I got a Ludric for Lockie. So I haven't really shot anything for myself. But yeah, we're fishing now. Hopefully we get some snapper. And got the new Stratic out. So that now that's an Australia lining. So I've just got a little ball sinker and circle hook, which is my go-to for snapper. So hopefully we can get one. Oh, ready. Oh, yeah. little snapper. That's well, legal. Yeah. First fish of the day. Nah, I've got a side of bait for me. Doesn't count. No, no, no. Fish on. You got a net, mate? I should have got Oh, I forgot the net. I knew I forgot something. Gaff it. I can feel the snapper, whatever it is, running through the reef. 
Oh, I'm literally just... Yeah. Grab this, Jed. Oh, no, he's done. Oh, oh no. Got him Grab this, the Jed. No. I'm going to gaff it if it's big. It's a good fish, eh? I reckon we just, you got the bottom. We just came and anchored up in about 13 metres. You might have got me just then. It's been done. Damn it. It's a fish. Oh. Oh, he's come out. Phew. I don't think it has, has it? Yeah. I don't know if it has. I know. It's that I think it's the nano. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'll just pull him in. Nah, no, he's good. Good hook. Nah, pull it. Oh, it's hooked good. Pull it tight. Oh, boy! <laughs> Bad one. Yeah, that's you. Wow. you beauty! That's what offshore's told me. <laughs> you! That's a good, good pan sized fish. That's a big pan. I think we're gonna need a bigger pan. I think we're gonna need a pot. <laughs> Happy with that. That's that's the first first fish on the Stratic. What I bought it oh. for. For the stray lining. Small sinker, circle hook, and it's hooked him just in the corner of the mouth. Really well, actually. I've reached my destination, and I'm going to go for a dive first, and then we'll get the rod out after I get back in. Hopefully, you can get a couple craze. Not going to take the gun, not going to worry about it. But yeah, I'll see you in the water. Phew. Mission sort of accomplished. I managed to find myself a new anchor. Well, not new, but I'll definitely still use it. And got an absolute donkey of a lobster. I only got the one, so it's kind of sort of accomplished. Like this thing is absolutely huge. It's like a dinosaur. I don't know how to show it. There's a power ray bottle. It's a it's a mammoth. We'll wait when we get home, but an absolute donkey of a lobster. And I'm stoked. We've got a brand new rod, sustain on the Zodius, absolute weapon. I actually haven't christened it yet, so <laughs> even though it's not my designated squid rod, I'm going to try and get some squid. I'll just go down on the rocks there and have a flick and stuff, and yeah, hopefully we can get something. If not, then we'll just have the cray, but hopefully, fingers crossed, we can get some squid. It is my favourite seafood. I'd love to have some for dinner tonight. Very cold morning down at home. It's Monday, I skipped uni to come fishing and diving with Jed. So yeah, we'll go pick Jed up in a minute and we'll get on the water. It's nice and cold though, but who cares? Hopefully we'll get some good fish and hopefully some craze. See you there. Ew. Go back. So first service.
just stopped to try and get some squid. It is so flat and it looks pretty clear. Like I've never really ever hammered just from the boat ramp to where I want to go. And that was the first time like I just didn't have to slow down for the swell or chop or anything. And it was just perfect. But yeah, you can see the bottom here. We're only in four meters of water, but it looks pretty clear. Just rocked up with the first spot. Got a bit smashed by the westerly coming here, but we're all good now. It's nice and nice and calm in here. It doesn't look as clear as before, but we're still going to jump in because it is a really good spot here. And even if it is a bit murky, you know, we should still be able to get some fish. Anchored up, and yeah, we'll jump in with the guns. Hopefully, get a few blue moies, maybe couple snapper blue moies are blue molong by the way i say it by their nicknames and my dad pointed out that i should probably tell you guys that might not know it that the actual name of the fish so blue molong and snapper maybe even a king you never know so yeah we'll jump in and we'll see in water Phew. fish for the first dive of the day the biz wasn't as good as we thought but there was just bait on bait on bait some rat kingies bonito salmon just eating the bait there's just so much out there i only managed two fish pretty surprised i thought i was gonna get a, a few more with all that bait but yeah we didn't see that many fish i'll show you what jed got two small bonito and a nice drummer for a feed pretty happy with that nice we'll probably dive again and we'll go back to a clearer spot i reckon and just see how we go but yeah, we got got a bit of a feed. Wouldn't mind a couple of crays and maybe like a snapper or something like that. But yeah, I guess you just got to try and see how you go at each spot and just hopefully it gets better and better. Fishing problems 101. So it's windy, as you can tell. This Wesley's pretty strong now. And <laughs> I'm trying to anchor, but I have enough chain on the anchor that it, it doesn't sit down. So it's pulling up and we just cannot anchor this stupid... Uh, reef anchor so i might even put the just the electric anchor down and do that instead so i jumped out because it just couldn't it just couldn't hold the bottom and my boat's going out to sea <laughs> so jed's still in there but i did see a few lobsters i actually saw one slipper lobster two easterns in the one hole but they were just too deep i wasn't gonna be able to get them out it's pretty cool but first first dive i did i saw him but that was pretty cool but yeah too deep we're gonna try a third spot once jed's done here and we should be able to anchor up a bit better there i will put the electric anchor down though because it's got 30 meters of chain so it will sit down because all the weight on the chain but this reef anchor because it's only got about one meter of a chain it's not sitting down it's just pulling straight up and it's just pulling out of every single hole we put it into it just keeps coming out no matter how deep it is it just, it just keeps pulling out so a bit annoying but you just got to deal with those kind of things and we'll put some more chain on it when i get home and fix that up and make it better for next time we come diving but yeah this is getting better and better the more we move so i'm pretty excited for the next spot next spot we're diving we're in the middle of nowhere kind of we're in a bomby i just put the electric anchor down and it's about eight meters there's like a little reef that comes up there we'll dive around it and see how we go the wind's backing off which is good but yeah it looks this looks decent we'll jump in and see in the water Woo!
bought heaps of medals and plastics and jigs at the last spot. In the logics, we've got a mad mixed bag, got an absolute stonker goat fish. Still got those bonitos, got a few more drummer, little king wrasse. Yeah, nice mixed bag. I did expect him to be a bit more, but 968 grams. Pretty happy with that guy. So he's been in the freezer for an hour, so I'll chop him in half. He should be dead or not be able to feel anything anyway. We'll cook these guys up shortly with the fish. And it should be good. Just preparing the fish, we've got the black drummer and the snapper. Both these are really nice, so that's all I'm eating. Bit of this garlic goodness. Yeah. Got our fish, got our lobster, got our chips. And got our salad. Dad's mine. Looks so good. Thank you for watching this episode. I'll see you next episode. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe. Me and Dad are going to get stuck into this. Looks delicious. I'll see you next time. You. Boys are in the drink, just bashing around a few plastics. Got me cranberry juice and the uh, sausage roll.